She is ready for creation. <gasps> What's going on? Where am I? I will train you to be a human. Okay. And your name is now? Hmm. Mars. Mars? Okay. My name is Dr. Neptune. Okay, Dr. Neptune. And you can also call me dad or father. Dad? What is that? Hmm. I have a lot to teach you. Six months later. <sighs> Back from school. What a nice day. Hey, Dad. Hey, honey. How was school today? It was amazing. Really? I'm so happy for that. Mr. Kipling is here to see you again, of course. <sighs> it's been such a long time since I've seen him. Since I was born. Hey, Mr. Kipling. Hello, Mars. Nice to see you again. How was school? It was great once again. <laughs> Hey, Dad, uh, you know, we've been living in this place for a while, and I know you said it's just because it was an abandoned warehouse, and it's just for all your tech and stuff, and, you know, nothing crazy goes down in here, but don't you think we should move houses or something? Move houses? Are you kidding me? Father, don't get mad at me, please. I just don't think we should be in this kind of place anymore. It's hot and smelly, and I always have to sleep on this tiny couch. I'm kicking you out. Huh? Yes. Since you want to move so badly, get out of my house. This isn't even a house. It's an abandoned warehouse. I just want to live somewhere where we can be a family. A family, huh? Yeah. Yeah, we can be a family. Down here. We're not going anywhere outside the open world besides school. You understand me? Now let me give you your pill of medicine. You need to eat. Thanks, father. And I understand. I'll be down here doing chores. <sighs> you make it seem like I'm a terrible parent. You're not, Dad. You're not. I'm just trying to do my job here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Back to work I go. Bro, my dad almost kicked me out the house yesterday. What? Really? I can't believe you would do such a thing. Why would he do that? Um, I don't know, honestly. He just got really mad. Uh, by the way, when can I come to your house and stuff? I want to meet your dad and all that. You know? I want to get to know him. <laughs> My dad? Trust me, you don't want to get to know my dad. Angry mode, activate. What the? Uh, hello? Are you okay? <gasps> what the heck just happened to me? Sorry, <clears throat> I'm gonna go now. Are you okay? Mariah! <sighs> what the heck has gotten into her lately? She's been acting so weird all of a sudden. Dad, I need you to come pick me up now! How'd you get here so fast? The power of my robot, of course. Right? Of course, servant. Anything to be at your service. Dad? Goodness. Okay, don't say Mars in here, okay? You know, nobody knows my identity here. What do you mean your identity? You're human. Yeah, I know that. But why don't I act human? Crazy things start happening to me. I start seeing things and then I start seeing things I don't want to say. Like angry mode activate. A miscalculation. Oh no. A miscalculation in what? What are you talking about, Dad? What is it that you're not telling me? Nothing, sweetheart. Now watch your mouth. <sighs> Dad, I'm so done with you right now. You're like keeping a secret from me. We've been staying underground in a secret warehouse for who knows how long. And, and, whoa, I need to record this. And, and, my name is Mars? Like, why is my name Mars and why not Mariah? There's something that you're hiding and I need to know. And why does my arm look like this? Honey, I told you that something happened to your arm when you were little. And why don't I remember? Uh, and where's my mom? Uh, and who are you? I'm your, I'm your father. What are you talking about, sweetheart? And why do we live in an underground lab with crazy rats and animals and Mr. Kipling and a robot? <gasps> Whoa, this is about to go viral. And how come every time I come home, you always are inventing something new and there's a crazy thing growing inside of our house. And you never want to move and we can't ever go outside and out to eat and we can't do anything like normal people do. Like, 
What are you hiding, Dad? Why aren't I normal? Honey, I'm sorry. I can't really explain all this at the moment. Sir, do you need anything? I'll be at your service. Shut up, robot! And you're mean to robots? Why do you even have a robot? Normal people don't have robots. Mars, watch your mouth. Are we normal? Um... And why do you look like a secret spy? Why don't you ever go outside and go to work? Why do you stand your ground all day? Why don't you have a job? Why aren't you a lawyer? What's wrong with you? Sir, I feel a bit low on battery. Will you please charge- Shut! Whoa! And he's mean to robots. <gasps> were, were you recording me? Hey, delete that! <laughs> no! Whoa! Samuel, look at this video! <gasps> Oh my gosh, can you believe this just happened? I can't. I know, it's crazy. I really can't believe that she's really born in a secret lab. Is this what I'm hearing? We should do some research. We should. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this right now. Oh my gosh, you're about to fall in love with an alien? How do you know she's an alien? I don't know. She said her name was Mars and she was born in a secret lab and stuff. And, and why she's a normal? It's all true. It's all true. Dad? You just got me in so much deep trouble because you're crazy. Was I born in a lab? Am I an alien? Am I real? <sighs> Honey, I'll explain this when we're home. You just exposed and exposed my identity and I can't be revealed to the public and you know that. I showed up to the school under one circumstance because my daughter was in trouble and you called for an emergency. Not because you're scared. Wow, you really aren't my father. Fathers care for the kids and not treat them like animals and robots. <sighs> Honey, come back. No, I'm never coming back home ever again. <sighs> if you guys want to see part two of this video, and I'm about to get on her and take her home so I can <sighs> reboot her since she's acting crazy. But I'll see you all later. If you guys want part two of my daughter is a secret alien and she was secretly born in a lab, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell so that you can be part of the egg fam. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.